Now, even if it's only for a few hours, it's a good idea to lift up the fleece and allow your plants to bask in this late winter sunshine. Isn't it absolutely glorious? And everything is really starting to grow again. And this is the nigella that I potted on yesterday. Do you remember? It's looking really perky in its new home. I think I'll just wait for this really cold snap to pass and then I think I'm going to start hardening off some of my plants. This sweet rocket is one of the first that will go outside under the cold frames. See the difference that this extra light is now making to the greenhouse. So we had a low of minus 3.5 last night and the high at the moment is 21.7. I think it got to 24 in here yesterday. It was, oh, it was heaven. Let me just put it onto Fahrenheit in case you're following from overseas. There we go. This is such a good example of why it's important that your plants have enough light. Look at this compost in these pots here, which is basking in the sunshine. And if I compare it to, to these pots over here, which are not getting nearly as much light, you can see they are still frozen solid. It's fine because they're only tulips. And by the time they come to start growing and poking their heads through the soil surface, the light levels will be so much better that this will get sunshine all day. But just at the minute, it's a very good example why your greenhouse needs to be in the right location. Look how much colder it is here.